all right yo what's going on guys crypto Corey here back with another video today i got something a little bit different for you a new series that i think i might start i think it looks i think it's a pretty good idea i don't know if you guys will like it or not but i think i'm just gonna start doing like maybe a, a series for now maybe just this week only could be a big series if it gets a lot of attention but i think for now i'm gonna do this series where i just just list quick list off of just a bunch of projects i think that you should be doing if, if this video gets a lot of views in like the first day i might do it every day i might just do it every other day i might just do it once a week i don't know so we'll see how it works out we'll see how you guys like it if you do like it just let me know man the subscribe button like and without further ado let's get right into it so I got five projects for you today, so let's go. So the first project, I'm, I mean, <laughs> I'm. How many times do I talk about three landers? I absolutely love three landers. I think it's an absolute amazing collection. I think the community behind it is absolutely beautiful. I think just everything about three landers is just amazing, and the art is just my favorite part, obviously. So we did see, I did see yesterday, did down <clears throat> to around a point three, point three, point four area, but. I mean, what, what are you going to do, you know? So, I think now, I did say before, I think it could dip even lower, and I, I did, I was right. So, as of right now, I think 0.3 is the optimal buy area for three landers. I don't think you'll see, like, you can see we have some sales, like right here, 0.3. Some other sales in that 0.3 area, but I don't think you will get any cheaper than 0.4 and 0.3 for some three landers. I think it's a very well, very good buy opportunity. I think from there, you could just make some tiny flips, like buy a 0.3, or flip it again. It just it's up to you. It's up to you. I just think three landers is an amazing project, and I don't think it's going to go ever. But obviously, everything in this video is not financial advice. It is just my opinion. So next part i got for you is cool man's universe i mean some people may have forgot about cool man's i didn't personally i just love the art for this project the community behind it is big and they are launching a secondary collection called like babies it's on twitter Let's see if we can just find that real quick uh no time no time i'll talk about that in a different video so they are launching a second collection called babies like cool man babies that are i guess their companions to the first project so definitely one you might want to keep an eye on it could maybe cause the floor to move up a bit 0.5 looks like a pretty good area for cool man's maybe we could see it go a bit lower today with only 16 sales so i think you could probably find some cheaper cool man's probably get some better buys for cool man's but i don't think that cool man should be going anywhere i think that it's a project that's just loved by a lot of people and i think it's it's going to be here for quite some time and i think you should clearly just keep an eye out for cold man's third project another project i absolutely love this and three landers are probably my favorite projects i need some water i beg your pardon <laughs> my god this and cool man's have, i'm not cool man's this and uh three lenders have been my absolute favorite projects i love both of these projects equally and now i think 0.6 and the 0.5 is probably the optimal buy area for this you could probably get a maybe a bit lower if you are lucky but i don't think i see cool <clears throat> that i see keiju kings going below that 0.5 area even 0.6 maybe just for a bit if we do look on their activity chart goodness oh my goodness Okay, if you do look at their activity chart, you can see there are some sales that went on today. It has six ETH sale, a lot of big sales, and I think you can see some 0.5 sales. So definitely you could get some good buys in if you do try, unless you're super lucky like this person who got it for 0 0.009. I'm not sure if this was a mistake or what whatnot, but it looks like there's some high sales that are going on so i definitely don't see keiju kings going anywhere that's for sure just because of the community behind it and even the art is pretty nice and next project <clears throat> might shock you but i don't think that this project may go anywhere i think a logics is definitely a project that had like a footprint in the free meta one of the first big projects that had a free mint and there's actually a lot of good things that come with this project a lot of utility you get some staking you get you alpha you get tools i think they have a partnership they have a partnership with alpha sharks i'm pretty sure i'm not 100 percent sure but i do think so and i do think that a 0.14 price for this could be pretty good maybe we can you can get it a bit cheaper as you can see some people picking up for 0.099 i mean what's the difference 0.079 
Some good buys you can get into. We did see a dip two days ago. I don't think that a logics may go anywhere. Obviously, this is my may be on the riskier side because it is a bit cheaper and not that many behind it. But a logics does look like a super solid project, and I think it, it could be here to stay as well. I don't think a logics we can see it go anywhere. And the final project I got for you today is Kara Furu. I really, really, really love Kara Furu. It's just been one of those projects that just launched at a bad time. And I think a lot of people say that if it launched at a better time, this could have been a blue chip project. And I honestly, I can't disagree with them because the art is just so unique on this project. Every item looks different. Everything looks beautiful. It all looks insanely good. All the art is amazing. And everybody knows about Kara Furu. It's a car. It's a collection that the whole NFT space knows about because so many collabs car through collabs with so many projects and i do believe that car through is easily one of the best projects it's a 555 collection so still pretty small 0.49 i don't think you can see car through go obviously below 0.4 maybe you somehow somewhere you get a 0.39 you're lucky but car through definitely a collection that you might want to keep on your radar and if we do look at their chart for activity it's it's pretty stable but definitely have high ups for car if especially during a bear market definitely a good project and one you may want to keep your eye out for next is the market analytics and we're done for the five projects i don't know if y'all like that i don't know if you thought it was interesting if you did man let me know so again we did see bitcoin pump up to 22k nothing obviously nothing insane ethereum 12k 1.2k and i will say this again i don't believe that we will see um as much price action in nfts until ethereum starts to stabilize until it starts to go a bit sideways like it was right here we had some fun times over here because it did stabilize a bit and that's when i think this area where the free myth meta was because ethereum did stabilize and it was looking pretty nice if you look at the analytics we also can see it was a 20 million dollar day yesterday nothing crazy nothing like these 29 million dollar days 26 it's whatever but today was a bit slower than the other days i think we could see some more volume on saturday because saturday just seems to be one of those days that everybody loves to get into nfts so it's whatever you know what i'm saying it's whatever and if we do look at the top collections nothing really crazy going on all the same as yesterday so if you did please guys please if you did like this video just let me know if you didn't like these videos i could go back to the other ones just let me know if you made it this far i really appreciate you god loves you and so do i good day good night and goodbye